Every four computers now have primary control of critical vehicle function. Ignition sequence start. Six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to Mission Control for another feature focus video. In this video, we're going to discuss setting up touch on an external screen. Occasionally, when hooking up an external touch screen or after doing a recovery, when touching the external touch screen, it will act as though it is working on the internal uh, console screen and not selecting anything on the external touch screen. This needs to be fixed without installing any drivers. Consoles that have not had the version 11.1 .1 or higher recovery run will require an external USB keyboard. If the console has had the version 11.1 .1 recovery or newer version 12 plus, we can set the program panel to keyboard mode, uh, but you can also use a USB keyboard if you wish. To set a console's program panel to keyboard mode, press and hold the locate and go keys until the faders LEDs flash once and the locate and go LEDs stay on solid for this takes approximately three seconds. Then click tools, control panel, touchscreen setup, window touch settings, and then click setup. Uh, these names may differ slightly on a Pearl Export or a Tiger Touch Pro. Then follow the on-screen instructions. Uh, click the first screen and then hit enter. Use enter on the keypad if you are able to put the panel in keyboard mode or just press enter on your USB keyboard. Once completed with all attached screens, close the tablet PC settings window. If you use keyboard mode, click stop on the panel and then click exit if you are in any menus. So let's see that in action. So you see here I've got a quartz and external display. If I touch on this screen here, we can see it's activating on the internal touch screen. So the first thing you want to go ahead and do is go ahead and press locate and go until they light up solid. It looks like it's flickering on here, but that's just a camera thing. Once you've done that, go ahead and click on tools and then control panel, then touch screen setup, and then windows touch settings. When that comes up, go ahead and click setup. And then on your first screen, you go ahead and tap on it, and then you'll press enter. And then on your second screen, you'll do the same thing. Go ahead and close the tablet PC settings, and then hit stop, and then exit to return your console back to normal. Then if we look at, look at our external screen, we'll see now that it doesn't, if we touch on this screen, it does not activate on our internal screen. It just only works on this screen itself. So that has been how to set up touch on your external screen on your Avalites console. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and see you in the next video. Thanks. Wheel stop. Roger, wheel stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.